A Confederacy of Dunces, by John Kennedy Toole is a comedic novel set in New Orleans, Louisiana, and follows the misadventures of Ignatius J. Riley, a larger-than-life and eccentric character who considers himself an intellectual genius but is often dismissed as a buffoon by those around him. The story begins with Ignatius, a 30-year-old man living with his overbearing mother, Irene, in the heart of the French Quarter. Ignatius is an educated but lazy and socially awkward man who spends his days writing in his big chief notebook and railing against what he perceives as the decline of society. His intellectual pursuits often lead him into absurd situations and conflicts with various people, including his employers, co-workers, and even the police. Ignatius's S life takes a tumultuous turn when his mother insists that he find a job to help support their household. Reluctantly, Ignatius takes on a series of bizarre and menial jobs, each ending in disaster due to his stubbornness, incompetence, and disdain for authority. His antics include working at a pants factory, a hot dog vendor, and a medieval-themed nightclub, among others. Throughout his escapades, Ignatius encounters a colorful cast of characters, including Myrna Minkoff, a radical feminist and former classmate who becomes infatuated with him, Jones, a hapless African-American janitor, and Officer Mancuso, a determined policeman who becomes fixated on bringing Ignatius to justice. As the story unfolds, Ignatius's absurd adventures escalate, culminating in a series of chaotic events that bring together the various characters in unexpected ways. Through a series of misunderstandings, mishaps, and miscommunications, the novel reaches a riotous climax that leaves readers laughing and scratching their heads in equal measure. At its core, A Confederacy of Dunces is a satirical exploration of the absurdities of modern life, the clash between individuality and conformity, and the complexities of human nature. John Kennedy Toole's sharp wit and keen observations of human behavior shine through in his portrayal of Ignatius and the eclectic cast of characters who populate the novel. Despite its initial rejection by publishers, A Confederacy of Dunces went on to win the Pulitzer Prize for Fiction in 1981, posthumously awarded to Toole, who tragically took his own life before the novel's publication. Today, the book is celebrated as a masterpiece of American literature, beloved for its uproarious humor, unforgettable characters, and biting social commentary. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for other interesting book summaries to spice up your reading list.